What's good, homo squad? It's your boy, homo Ziggy. We back here with another reaction for y'all. And hey, it's like this, y'all. I don't care if I was late to this and such. All I know is I haven't heard it yet. So we here with Screwface John stirring the pot, Mari Deda 2. Now, if you haven't, go check out my other three reactions to where the beef between 954 Mari and Schoolface John and such. All I gotta say is this, right? Ever since that whole nerd control thing, right? And when 954 came to respond, the fact that it was barely only just one this, just one little jab at Jamar, but for the rest of his first response and such, was mostly aimed towards Screwface John. And it's like this, people say, and I heard some in my comments where technically this would be like round one or whatnot. It's like this, right? Even though this, even though the first one itself was, even though it said Mari better, even though the first one, Mari better, was mostly just addressing some things and not mostly at a diss track towards him. Hey, I still count it as it for me. But either way, people say that this, I see like other reactions, and when I mean see, I mean like see like the thumbnail and captions and such, and saying that this probably could be the end. So hey, we'll see how it goes for me. So we better check this out. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my socials out there. And without further ado, let's get in the video. Um, see that first track, you wasn't touching that. Dog, you a zombie, but it's on me, so it's the double tap. <sighs> Niggas say they love negativity, but they got the inability to deal with it, so they gotta deal with it, so let's deal with it. <laughs> I had fun with him last time. This time I'm gonna really talk to him. Come here. Man, this nigga is ignorant, homie still trippin', I switch my opinion, nah, nigga, I didn't I say I don't like it, then I'm just a critic, I say something nice, now you postin' my pictures Let's talk about Twitter, I'll show you the difference, I go to Twitter promoting your killin' You go to Twitter to show you a victim and show that you isn't the nigga in ratings Who loadin' the clip and the sticker that's spinning and saying that you is the best when you spittin' And claiming that you ain't got no competition, so you told to compete, then you get in your feelings I run a nine like so many times, them shots in your lines was a hit and cheap liquor I work with Fantano, I sent him a list of the spitters and he ain't know you little nigga Saying that niggas is riding my dick when them niggas trying to save you is different That first round you didn't survive, but some got to lie and make me the villain But fuck it, I get it, you just have your chance to get out them feelings you have for a minute You know we know what it is and it is, and still got love for niggas, but I know the business You bringing up up church, you gon' side with a racist to try to deface this, it's effing bizarre You can side with a racist, and he did bring up up church in his one In the I love my fans one, where he's saying about how he trying to wanna beat beef with up church and such. But let's face the facts. Up church, you see the rebel flag. Ah it is what it to me I don't business with that wise and such. Me, I never know he was this whatever and such. But hey you gon' the fact that you brought up a racist in this whole niggas, but I know the business. You bringing up up church, you gon' side with a racist to try to deface this. It's effing bizarre. Run corn husker with Nebraska. Oh, that's gut lap there. Yeah, he hmm. with a racist to try to deface this. It's effing bizarre. Run corn. Run corn husker with Nebraska. Oh yeah, cause I, cause if I'm not in one of it's like this, right? Back in the YouTube rap scene, right? Where there was a beef between Schoolface John and Upchurch. And in one of Upchurch's other response to the song, right? He rhymed corn, as you see right here, corn hucker with Nebraska. I get, I don't know how did, well, it didn't rhyme to be honest. No, I don't care how much of an accent you got in such. You could not rhyme corn hucker with Nebraska. Doesn't, I don't care. It does not rhyme. With Husker with Nebraska. Oh, that's gut lap there. Yeah, he blessed me with bars. Soft shoe gap, blaming at random at his feet for tap dancing. Will you Kanye West rant? Temper tantrum, have an internet savage. Diss me for ERB, but that's precious. I cosplay this kid for one second. Mm. 
you do. I mean, it is. I mean, even though at the end of the day, even though he cosplayed in ERB, let's face the facts. If we're talking about how it is, let's face it. Mansa Musa, he was a king. From learning from school phase, John, he was a king and such, so. At the end of the day, he still got you one. Without yeah. blaming at random, at his feet for tap dancing. Well, you Kanye West ran, temper tantrum, have an internet savage. This me for ERB, but that's precious. I cosplay this kid for one second. Difference is the character you preparing for, seeing your fucking reflection. The man in the mirror you see before breakfast, before you want to microphone checking. Use that same flow, rhyme with no presence, then hop in a session and lie about weapons. You pass on face, you pass a face, I like it. You, pa you pass on face, you pass a face. I just like the inner, I just like when rhyming, people always do that, they, you pass the fist, you pass the fist. Always that same flow, rhyme with no presence, then hop in a session and lie about weapons. You pass on fist, you pass a fist, I like your suit. Came dressed in your casket fit, the casket fit, a cast the kid. So I can room for this bastard and anybody after him. Said my pen name matches his. That was clever. Lie detector say that's a fib. I can't tell if your passion's rapping or watching reactions. That's when you passionate. Let me teach you a lesson like a fucking man. Don't throw rocks and start tucking your hands. Mention me on your little song, you can smoke like a bong into rapping. You wouldn't understand. Trying to tell me what real niggas do. <laughs> oh, really? That's cute. Real niggas wouldn't this move gun, huh? Well, real nigga, what about you? Mm. And I like how he said. <laughs> oh, really? That's cute. Real niggas. Real niggas wouldn't this move gun, huh? Well, real nigga, what about you? Mm, how about you? Let's see what it says here. Hey, Luke Gone, the infamous lyrical physics. I wonder if you would be down to link up with the demon of the sound and make the worst YouTube rap of all time and just go insane bar for bar. Damn, Mario, you can't, Mario, you can't be doing that now. You can't be saying real niggas beef with Luke Gone and then have this. Hey, this is what happens when you actually bring up real facts and such. Not saying that Mari didn't do it too, but I'm just saying. You can't be talking one thing when he literally. <laughs> oh, really? That's cute. Real niggas wouldn't this Luke gun, huh? Well, real nigga, what about you? Real niggas send lyrical threats, then really get checked, then send out use. Maybe I say I won't go back and forth. Maybe there's. Boy, then go back and forth. Then go back and forth and be a real nigga too. Wayne and Saturday bumping you. Way harder cause you fuck with screw. Nigga, you should just start rapping about me. When you rap about bleach, you don't get as much as I do. I'm stirring the pot, I'm stirring the pot. That damn fizzle, why you hit him so hard? I'm stirring the pot, I'm stirring the pot. I used to fuck with this nigga a lot. I'm stirring the pot, I'm stirring the pot. And got him thinking nigga box with the gods. I'm stirring the pot, I'm stirring the pot. A lot of your people been hitting the ball. I'm stirring the pot, I'm stirring the pot. That damn fizzle, why you hit him so hard? I'm stirring the pot, I'm stirring the pot. I used to fuck with this nigga a lot. I'm stirring the pot. A district, but he's turning this into a song. Yeah. Um. I'm gonna show you how to really switch it up when we switch them beats. Uh, look. What stupid men say, school gon' lose in this pen race This here for you, for thinking little dude was gon' move the sensei If he move, do his neck like the leg off a cool to Kente Pull the plug, got to look at them strangers, he choose the end game Got to look at this strange, he choose the end game mm. Hey, all I gotta say is this, right? Mari, I got love for you, no matter what, right? GD boys, right? But dude, all I'm saying is, right? How you gonna come at school? You should have known, even though whatever, right? But still, you know school is a. You you guys were on the cipher, right? Together, World War Cipher Two. By the way, if you haven't go check out my reaction to that. You know how his pen game is. And plus, when it comes to just dish, distracts my G. You should have man. All I gotta say is you should have known. If you're gonna wanna come at facts with school, make sure they are hard. They're just coming straight at you. They coming 
no, no ifs, ands, or buts that something school can't even rebuttal back. So. And school gon' lose in this pen race This here for you for thinking Lil' dude was gon' move the sensei If he move, do his neck like the leg off a cool to Kente Pull the plug, got to look at him strange As he choose the end game Niggas bump my songs and ask for reactions That got me stacking That just means they grasping both of my passions You hustling backwards You ain't have to change your promotion taxes To get some traction What happened to the niggas you was rapping with Before the animatics Before you saw the dudes get the views With the nerd rapping Swerve back and use that in your chat To get some traffic And he wanna talk about accountability But literally Really just can't admit that he dissing me cause he can't take real critiques he easily gotta be mm. I mean he, he ain't wrong like you taking you talking about accountability and such taking accountability for your actions but my G if you got a real rapper like school right cause he cause it's like this with school he oh you know he's always gonna take no matter what you rapping for and such no matter what music he put out you know he's gonna judge it in his you know he's gonna put out his critique whether they whether it's a good one or whether it's a bad one at the end of the day right he's not saying that you are ass or nothing like that he's just telling you how it is in his music form and such so and you can't be in your feelings because if you if you're in your feelings as an artist if you're in your feelings about how a certain other people whether they're a fan or a rapper and such nigga sometimes even though you should not give a damn about their opinions nine times out of ten the difference between opinions and critiques a critique is trying to make something they're trying to tell you especially if it's a rapper like school if he's telling you a good critique or something right take that advice and go with it but if it's an opinion then you shouldn't really fucking matter about that because at the end of the day what if they're like like I, like I said opinions don't matter opinion is just something somebody just want to say out it may not be right but it may not be wrong it just is. Swerve back and use that in your chat to get some traffic. And he wanna talk about accountability, but literally just can't admit that he dissing me cause he can't take real critiques. He easily gotta be the dumbest nigga to beef with me. His words say that I'm wrong, but his actions actually agree with me. Like, what you doing right now? Battling, right? You said my name, I took the challenge, now you battle for life. See how you did? didn't have to cry and whine by not trying to fight? Just grab the mic, you realize you proved I'm actually right. And bitch, I never said I did a tour with Tekka K. Dot. Whoever you had digging up dirt was hitting straight rock this shows that mm. whoever you had digging in dirt was in straight rocks the dirt rocks but rocks as in the such and he never did a tour well true he didn't he didn't say that he did a tour with he never said he did a tour he did say that he performed he performed with Tech Nine and such, and K and K Dot, Kendrick Lamar. He didn't say he went on tour with them, so. Did a tour with Tech K Dot. Whoever you had digging up dirt was hitting straight rock. This shows at home with them niggas. I tell you what I did with it, but this could take a minute, so fuck it, I'll get specific. So that shows by myself. Hit the road by myself. Enough dough and distro could pay a loan by myself. I get picked at every place I fucking go by myself, but I'm too known, so I can't even fucking go by myself. Nothing closer than niggas saying what they would do is you. Like, nigga, worry about you so you can start making some moves. You Because it's like this. People want to say about, if I was in your shoes, I would have done this and that and the third. But nigga, that's the thing. You saying if you was in their shoes. Well, here's the facts. You're not in their shoes. They got their, whatever they do with their life, that's on them. Whatever you got to do with your life, that's on you. So, Mari, he kind of got you right there. You cannot say that. If you was on, if you was in school shoes, you would have went through those movies. You would have did those shows, sell out more, and so and so, right? You can't say that, but nigga, that means you're being a fanboy to him. You gotta worry about your music and such, worry about your moves and such, and so that way, if you wanna do what you were saying to school about, if you was in K dot shoes and whatnot, make moves for your, make your own moves so that way certain shit like that could happen to you 
Not trying to diss you, not trying to be rude or anything, but do. Don't talk shit like that. If you ain't gonna fucking go by myself, but I'm too known, so I can't even fucking go by myself. Nothing close to the niggas saying what they would do is you. Like, nigga, worry about you so you can start making some moves. You keep watching other dudes, that's your problem, you little fool. Like, what the fuck you plan to do when they don't care about this fuse? And it's back to them views, they're gonna start lacking, it's true. You'll probably get to slacking and not dropping raps again, too. If I'm the con, the goddamn fam, you really a scam. Look how my reaction got you acting, bitch, who really the fan? You really a stand, let me start a hat and get this man if you can mm, you really just stand let me sign ahead and give it to this man Ooh. i would never let my girl i would never let my girl go to dream con that shit like black youtube and anime all star weekend if you can't take your girl to dream con then she ain't can't take your girl to dream con she ain't feeling you fam this nigga thought he was the rock he more pebbles and bam bam but the 40 to 9 like he be fanning for san fran we warriors man don't try This nine, you mean San Fran, San Francisco, the 49ers. Mm. Bam, bam, but the 40 to 9, like he be fanning for San Fran. We warriors, man. Don't try to war with his fam, or we'll make another crazy headline out of Florida, man. Said a Nebraska can't beat you, you delirious, damn. What well, if a Nebraska can't beat you, this Nigerian can? The way you. <clears throat> evil quit. Look, I'm not evil. Hold on, before anything, right? I'm Jamaican, but. The many times when I hear his school goes into his Nigerian, cause let's face it, he said it before. He's literally a village boy. He ain't wanna. He, he's not doing it for no promotion or so. Nah, he he. You hear it many times from him. He's really a village boy. He really comes from where, in Af where in Africa, you would. The only way you can get water is where you get one of those buckets. Get them like buckets and such. Carry it in your head throughout it, and you use that for washing your clothes, cooking, and all that. I'm Jamaican, so we don't do stuff like that. But trust me, fool, if it's basically like this for me, from my point in Jamaica, right? There's like the countryside, and then there's like, in a way, the town city side and such. Me, I live in Greater Portmore in Jamaica. It quick look, this may be a little story, but yeah. I live in Greater Portmore in Jamaica, so it's not much of like a countryside, but it's more of like a city side, but not like a big, big city, you know. It's like a little, it's like a good little city, good little neighborhood and such. And trust me, the if if you live where I lived in Jamaica, right, in my area, and whenever you're gonna walk to a supermarket, you would literally at every corner, almost every corner, you would literally see a street vendor right there. Where they have mango, where they have coconut, where they have bam, like cane and such, sugar cane and such, all of that. And you know how much them would be? In Jamaica, they would be like $50 or so. So trust me, I get what school, in a way I get school, but, but no, actually I do get what school saying, so trust me, if don't make a Nigerian if you saying that Nebraska can't do can't come at you, then don't let this. The war with his fam, or we'll make another crazy headline out of Florida, man. Said a Nebraska can't beat you, you delirious, damn. What if a Nebraska can't beat you, this Nigerian can? The way you flip my words to fix the narratives is just embarrassing. Half the shit you try to say, I said I really never did. Like I ain't say going on Twitter was the problem. I said the problem was going on Twitter when you dodging. You can't do much. About Right there, true. But if I were to, he so hold on. So if I'm gonna take it like this, right? He's saying he didn't say going on Twitter was the problem. Twitter was the problem. I said the problem was. I said the pro. Sorry if y'all can't see it, but I said the problem was going on Twitter when you dodge it. So in a way, that's kind of so. I guess what school is trying to say is like he never said nothing's wrong with going on Twitter, right? But when it comes to certain distracts and such, right? If you got a distract, if some, if people are gonna diss you on a certain song, right? You cannot be like a, don't go on Twitter. Basically, don't go on social media and area of grievance out there. Do it on the song. 
So in a way that I really never did like I ain't say going on Twitter was the problem I said the problem was going on Twitter when you dodging You care too much about this reactions that you be watching You even put reactions on disses that you be dropping Nigga log off don't log in Don't like me don't watch him Nigga love me yo leave me alone Your only option huh Shout out to Hova that's a lesson that he taught me This Mari packet got me wheezy got me coughing <laughs> This shit too easy man at this point, I'm just having fun, man. <laughs> this is what I do, bruh. Listen, Mari's dead until infinity, bruh. Mm, damn. Hey. Well, all I can say is, this probably is a, because let's face it, even though I'm a late to this and such, let's face the facts. Ever since then, I ain't hear no response yet from Mari, so I know I might be, I know I'm like six days late to this reaction, but hey, it is what it is. But hey, all I gotta say is with this, Mari, I know you got another song, I know you got a upcoming song with you, Ham Sandwich, and Ty Wild coming up soon, but hey man, I'm just gotta say this, my G, hopefully you can just like score squash this whole thing with screw maybe I'll talk it out and such text each other or whatnot and such find a way how to like squash this whole entire thing cause trust me if the both of you two come on a song together right man I don't care what Mung Fu would want to say and such cause I know he's gonna want to say something about it but me all I say is this come together you and screw just talk it out don't try in a way you want to fight it out but Come together, find a way how to squash this whole thing, and then trust me, if you two, if you and school come on a song together, oh my god, do you know how many eyes are gonna be on you, boy? I'm just saying. But hey, y'all let me know what y'all thought about this in the comments below. Let me know, is this the end of it? Because, like I said, lately and such, having hear no other response from Mari, so... Hope this is finally it. But y'all let me know what y'all thought about this in the comments below. It's been your boy Humble Ziggy signing out. Stay positive and keep the vibes up. Lego.